The Italian Prime Minister says his country should turn the coronavirus crisis into an opportunity to push through long delayed reforms. Giuseppe Conte uh, announced plans to simplify bureaucracy, improve education and support the poorest. Italy is said to be the largest beneficiary of a huge EU recovery fund. Russia has reported more than 8,000 new coronavirus cases on Saturday, uh, raising its total to over 520,000. It means the country has the third highest figure in the world after the US and Brazil. Its official death toll stands at nearly 7,000, many times lower than the figure seen in other countries with serious outbreaks. Canadians have been reacting to disturbing footage which has emerged showing police punching and applying a chokehold uh, on an Indigenous chief in Alberta. It's prompted the Prime Minister to call for an independent inquiry into the incident. The release of the video coincides with recent protests in Canada calling for police reform in the wake of the death of George Floyd in the US. Bridget Ahmed reports and a warning some viewers uh, may find some of the following scenes upsetting. It's nearly 12 minutes of difficult to watch dash cam footage. Initially, there are tense exchanges. Chief Alan Adam grows increasingly frustrated with police officers. An officer and Mr. Adam continue in heated argument. As the situation deteriorates and more officers arrive, one is seen running, tackling Mr. Adam to the ground. He repeatedly punches him while shouting, don't resist, as bystanders plead with him to stop. Before this footage was released publicly, police said they had viewed the video and found the officer's actions reasonable. Mr. Adam later released a picture of injuries he says he sustained in the attack. The incident is now being investigated by the Alberta Serious Incident Response Team, but the Canadian Prime Minister is calling for an independent inquiry, and he and other officials are now talking about racism in the Royal Canadian Mounted Police. The events that have been brought to light over the past days highlight that without question, uh, there is systemic discrimination uh, within our institutions, including within the RCMP. We need to move forward to correct that. Mr. Trudeau, seen here taking a knee at a recent anti-racism protest in Ottawa, has himself faced serious criticisms of his government's track record on Indigenous issues and personal allegations too of racism after photos surfaced of him in blackface. But this latest footage of Mr Adams' violent arrest comes at a 